I can be fun. We no we no we no I can be fun. We no we no we no I can't touch this hey we got me rich shit huh I can't touch this hey walk the limp limp huh I'm gonna be ding 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 What's good, Poppy YouTube? It's your girl Nisa TM. That's me just too much, and I'm just back with another YouTube video. So if you know me, you know I don't do the long intros, and I like that. Um, so if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Join the Too Much Gang, because baby, if you're not too much, then you're just not allowed to have period. Are you with your mom and I me? Like, what's up? So, if y'all already started this video, um, y'all already know this is about to be how to start a lash company. Like, I've done two videos on this now. Um, now I'm doing one, how to do it on a budget. Um, this is strictly numbers. Like, I'm speaking all numbers in this video. I'm not giving my personal opinion on anything because numbers don't lie. I don't lie either, but the black and white numbers, they don't lie. They never have total lies. So, I just want to give y'all some insight on some numbers to, you know, get y'all, get y'all brains generating, get y'all thinking about what your next move is. If you start it, if you're trying to start, whatever your situation is, I'm here to help you. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. Again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Join the Too Much Gang. Um, we have a lot of videos coming this week, so let's get right into the video. Okay, so everybody know when I get my business videos, like I got to have the notes. Like I gotta have the tea to get to y'all when I do these videos. Um, and I don't want this video to be too long. I know I always say that and then the video will be like 30 minutes, but that's not gonna be the case this time. So, jumping right into what I have. Um, like I said, we're just talking strictly numbers on this video. Um, so the first question of course is how much do you need? You need roughly 65 to hundred dollars to start a lash company. I personally started my lash company with I think like a hundred dollars somewhere around there. Um, and that was just me personally testing products. Um, and that's what you want to do. You want to make sure um, you make your money stretch. You want your you want your money to work for you. You don't want to work for the money. And that's the point of being an entrepreneur, being able to generate your own revenue, things like that. So like it's plain and simple, 65 to hundred dollars. Y'all, y'all need to be able to get $65 to $100. I don't care if you have to do chores. I don't care if you have to borrow it. The only person that needs to believe in you is you at this point. Like, if you're watching this video, if you've been researching, doing what you need to do to get this business started, the only person that you that needs to believe in the vision or the brand or whatever it is that you have going on or that you're trying to start is you, literally. Not your mama, not your sister, none of them. You need strictly you. And your belief, your faith, and you need to stand on that when you start your company, period. Okay, so the next thing I get asked a lot about is uh, buying vendors lists. So um, me personally, I've never bought a vendors list, um, but I, ha I have heard it's been beneficial. In some cases, it really is a 50-50. You could buy a vendors list and it could, go gr it could go green, or you could buy a vendors list and it could flop. And you know, now, now you're out of you know, $40, $50, whatever it is you spent to buy the vendors list mind you the first question how much you need to start i said 65 to 100 dollars. so buying a vendors list is kind of like a risk in a way um but i do not cross that you know option out if that's what you feel like you need to do definitely do your research on it look at reviews look at comments do all of that before you spend your money always 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 research before you have to spend your money with somebody to buy a vendor like I, you know i used to sell my vendor i don't anymore um, but my vendor was legit. So, like, I there's some people who will sell a vendor's list, and it's not the actual vendor that they use. I was selling the vendor that I actually use. So, just be aware. Of, just be aware of that. Excuse me. Um, so, next thing, what to look for in a vendor? I get this question a lot. I get this question so, so, so much. So, in my profession, like in my business, these are the things that I look for: um, quality, for sure, uh, transparency um production time and um price so um those four things i feel like if they're like you know some highs and some lows in there um if you could tweak it out with a vendor um quality do not compromise on quality that's a never no we're always quality over quantity quality keeps the people coming back okay regardless of whatever else goes on with your brand make sure your quality is on point make sure nobody nobody is able to tell you about your brand Somebody could try and say, oh, the lashes, blah, 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 blah. No, you should know your, your products like the back of your hand. One thing about it, I get lots of complaints about other things, but when it comes to that product, I have no complaints. 
that's a fact people who have said very mean hurtful things about me my customer service my shipping time have never complained when their products hit they will even admit the product is great you're not like that's their own opinion like it is what it is but definitely never compromise on the product uh quality because that's just a no do not try and get a couple dollars or get ahead by selling trash quality because that is very hard to get off of your name i've never sold any bs to anybody i could not live with myself if i did something like that so make sure quality is top of the line um when i say transparency transparency is them letting you know what they can do for you and your company um a lot of vendors will try and like sugarcoat it in a way um for instance i had that problem when i first started getting a lot of wholesale orders um my vendor was like oh we can keep up like we can do that we can do that and come to find out like they don't have enough employees like at this point i'm asking them how many employees do you have because it's just me and my mom at first it was just me but then it was me and my mom so if this is what i'm like if what i'm doing with just two people how many people do you have and how can you guys all help me you know supply my demand you know what i'm saying so transparency is so so important um letting you know like this is what i can do for you um if we work together for this long you know this is what we offer blah 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 transparency is key um i follow that with my heart even if you know it causes enemies or people who don't want to purchase anymore i'm very transparent especially when it comes to my my business and my brand because i don't want somebody to be like oh you said this and then not me not be able to back that up anything i've ever done i've stood on i've spoke on um i do whatever i need to do in order to protect my brain and that's what you guys need to do as well protect your brain at all costs make sure you know honesty is policy like honesty and transparency um that's what i go by that's how i run that's why i feel like good things happen to me good things happen to my brand because i'm so transparent with everything if i'm if it's on my if it's on my part i let you know okay that that's on me i apologize if it's on your part i'll see how we can compromise so we can meet in the middle but at the end of the day transparency is key if the vendor is not transparent about what they offer about what they about what they can offer you and your brand you definitely want to cross them out for sure you don't need no niches no glitches and your brand when it comes to when it comes time for you to pay your money and get your products and that's period okay next thing uh production time something that i had to work on personally myself um but if you're looking for an outside vendor outside of me you want to make sure the production time is in a timely manner um from china now and i will say this smaller orders that come from china usually take five to seven days i will say that um if you're order, ordering in larger quantities about nine to twelve days uh that's me personally i'm ordering uh roughly three thousand four thousand lashes every single week so um it's about nine to twelve days before i get them um i do have an import license now um i did speak about that in my last video if you didn't see it make sure you go check that out um, i think it was the last stream that i did the live stream um but i do have an import license so that is helping a little bit cut down on time that way um when it goes through customs they're like okay she's licensed we don't have to check her packages like let her go through um so definitely definitely production time if you're ordering directly from china five to seven days if you're ordering a small quantity i would say under 250 or 300 um that's like a like a roughly like a range uh time frame that they should be shipping to you um and because that's what they used to ship to me um when i was ordering smaller quantities um if you are planning on ordering larger quantities you are gonna have to wait a little while longer um which is what i am learning how to have more things on hand how to like manage uh products how to manage customers orders things like that um i just recently revamped my website and things like that so that that i would have no issues like i should have no issues with my vendor i should have no issues with my customers um everything should be smooth sailing uh for my relaunch july july 17th which is when i uh, reopen my wholesale so um definitely pay attention to production time make sure that's what the first question that you ask them if you're on a website about to purchase from somebody make sure you go to their store policy reading is key okay y'all y'all have to read you're about to be a business owner if you're currently a business owner if you're not reading policies terms conditions there is something seriously wrong because you could sign something that says oh yeah 
um they're gonna give me a thousand free lashes and then in the fine print it says but you don't get any of the money you just get free lashes you get what i'm saying so make sure you guys are reading pay attention to what you're purchasing i know a lot of people when they purchase for me they be so excited like oh my god i'm so excited to purchase for me sure i can't wait and then they don't read and then it causes like misconfusion so business owners that's, that's how i'm about to address y'all like y'all are business owners business owner please make sure you're reading terms and conditions terms and conditions and store policies okay please that's like my only request make sure you guys are reading make sure you know exact like you you just need to know what you're purchasing and what it all entails next thing is price y'all price i get some of the craziest youtube comments about how vendors are overcharging them because they're new or they don't know what they're talking about like when I say communication is key, y'all need to know how to talk to these people, okay? Y'all need to be able, y'all need to know how to bargain. Y'all need to know how to get what y'all want from these vendors because they can definitely give it to you. Um, that brings me into a uh, price range for lashes. Now, I'm not going to give my price range for what I get my lashes for because that's none of nobody's business. You just know I get them for the low. And I'm able to get them for a super cheap price so that I can help other people start companies. Um, and I'll talk about that a little bit later. So, if you're paying $3 a pair, you're getting ripped off, okay? $3, if, if, if you're paying $3 a pair, baby, baby, listen to me. You're getting ripped off, okay? That is entirely too much money. I don't care if they're offering you 100 pair at $3. You're getting ripped off, okay? And these are things that you learn as you go. Um, so uh, I would say a comfortable price range will be around like two dollars and fifty cents. Um, you know, two dollars flat, two twenty, two thirty. But if you're paying more than, I want to say like two. If you're paying more than like two, two seventy, two seventy five, like you're you're really getting ripped off because it's, even though you can resell them for ten dollars best believe there's a vendor out there that has better quality and better pricing like you need to be able to pinpoint the best pricing that you could possibly get okay you need to be able to pinpoint it um once you start ordering larger quantities you need to be able to reach out to that vendor like hey i'm not ordering 100 anymore i'm ordering a thousand so so what can we drop this price to what can we get it to i personally just reached out had meetings with all of my vendors for sunglasses um i'm getting a lip gloss vendor and um my lashes and i let them know like hey if y'all if you guys want to continue to do business with me y'all need to lower my rates okay and guess what they all lowered the rates and there there was no misconfusion my sunglass lady did give me a little bit of trouble um but at the end of the day after about 45 minutes of me going back and forth with her and you know me explaining my situation and if they want you know i'm giving them thousands of dollars like y'all need to be able to help me the same way that i help y'all um, and then she ended up speaking to her uh, warehouse manager and then we agreed on the price, which is completely fine with me. Um, so at this point, 88% of what I make from uh, my, my total business will be profit to me. So that's really, really good. Most businesses, if you guys didn't know, they don't profit, they don't even profit 50%. So for me to profit 88 um, is really, really good. Um, as a new business owner, I'm only in my like third year, three and a half years. Um, so that's really, really good. So make sure you guys are negotiating your bargaining um, and if you don't want to deal with any of that if you don't want to have to find a vendor and, and question if the quality is okay and n find somebody that's transparent listen I don't understand why you haven't purchased from my wholesale program yet I'm going to insert a comment from one of my um, subscribers one of my clients she literally let everybody know from my program within two months she made three thousand dollars just from my program personally so we're gonna pull out the numbers okay we're gonna pull out the numbers i'm gonna let y'all see for yourselves get y'all calculators get y'all pens get y'all pencils i want y'all to do these numbers y'all selves so that y'all can see that this is real like the program that i offer literally helps set you up for success to the point where you won't have to work literally so let me grab my phone. I'll be right back. And we're going to get into these numbers. I'm going to pick your week. Okay. So what we have here is a chart for my wholesale program. And I'm just going to break it down to you so you can see how you can make maximum profit from selling your lashes for $10 a piece. Okay. This is not a game. This is not a gimmick. 
y'all get your calculators out y'all can do the math yourselves so this is how um and it's kind of like a pyramid um not pyramid scheme though okay baby this is the pyramid money train okay like what's up so um we're gonna start and i'll insert it right over here so we're gonna start with the 10 pair for my 25 millimeter lash collection i sell 10 pair for 65 dollars that means each pair is six dollars and fifty cents mind you i said if you're purchasing directly from the vendor three dollars is too much if you're purchasing from the u.s just listen to how this is going to help you okay so 10 pair that means you're getting each pair for six dollars and fifty cents okay you're reselling those same lashes for ten dollars a piece you're going to make a hundred dollars which is where it says gross revenue now let me break it down retail is what you sell it for okay wholesale price is what you get it for when you multiply the quantity by the retail price you get your gross revenue gross revenue is what you make conclusively profit is what you take home okay so with that you make a hundred dollars gross revenue you profit 35 now this is why the wholesale program is meant to help those start small and grow bigger once you make your first $100, profit comes from taking the money you need to reinvest to get more lashes to keep going, okay? You see what I'm saying? So, most of y'all are working, most of y'all are going to work. Spare $65 and watch how this works magic for you. Once you sell your first 10 pair, take that whole $100, add $15 to it, okay listen to what i'm saying at 15 dollars to it move up in sales okay if you don't want to add 15 if you just don't have that extra 15 to squeeze in there purchase 10 pair again purchase 10 pair again 65 dollars. you already have 35 you're going to make another hundred dollars you're going to add that 35 in that's 135 and then you move up like that does that make sense make sure y'all are following me okay there's two ways to do it you can add more or you can repurchase that same that same pair that same quantity make another hundred dollars add your 35 and move up in lashes okay so now we're on 30 pair 30 pair cost 115 you're going to resell again and this is the minimum y'all this is you, you you can sell your lashes for 12 dollars 15 dollars 20 dollars but this is just the minimum you can make so i want to try to play with these numbers tonight and make sure y'all sign up for my restock alert when y'all see that this is the program that you've been waiting for to start your company. So, one fifteen, you sell for ten dollars. Thirty pair times ten dollars is three hundred dollars. Do that math again. You took a hundred and fifteen dollars, bought thirty pair of lashes, sold them for ten dollars each, and made three hundred dollars gross revenue. Your profit one eighty five. So think about it. Even though you were getting the lashes for $6.50 in the beginning, you moved up in lashes. So let's do the math together. If that's 30 pair, and I want y'all to see me do it too. So 30 pair, or sorry, excuse me, you want to do 115 divided by 30 pair. That's $3.83. You moving down the chain and you moving up in profit. So we're gonna continue to do this. We're gonna continue to do this math together. Okay, so you got three hundred dollars now. Woohoo! You 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 racking it in. You racking it up. Okay. You want to move up in lashes once again. Fifty pair. I sell fifty pair for one seventy five. Okay. So let's do the math and see how much you're getting them for for at one seventy five. So one seventy five. Divided by 50 pair is, hmm, 350. I think somebody's moving down once again. So, we're going to do 50 pair times $10. That's $500 gross revenue. You only spent $175. Let's keep that in mind. You're only spending $175. You profited $325. That's pocket change. Three hundred. Think about this: an extra 
$325 a month. That's money you could use to cater to yourself. That's money you could use to get, you know, things for your home. Like, this is, I don't see what the issue would be with making extra pocket change, okay? From a USA-based vendor who has everything you need, shipping times are, sh shipping prices are cheaper, and shipping time frames are shorter. Just keep that in mind. So, now that you got your $500, girl, we're going to move up to 100 pair of black. Like, come on now. Like, we, we get into the top of the food chain, okay? So, at 100 pair, you get them for $295. So, anybody can do that simple math. $295 divided by 100 is $2.95. The more you order for me, the cheaper that price is going down, Okay. I'm trying to make it as cheap as possible so you can make your maximum profit, okay? So this is simple basic math. This is math 101. You spent $2.95 for 100 pair of lashes. You take 100 pair times $10, that's $1,000. Mind you, you only spent $2.95. So that means you profited $705. Now, since you're at the top of the food chain, you don't have to go back down. You keep using that 1,000 to go up and up. So you have $705, okay? You already put your money back. You already put your 295 back to buy another 100 pair. So that's another $1,000. Now you have $1,700. Does that make sense? I hope y'all follow me. Like I'm hope I hope I'm breaking this down to the point where like y'all can understand where I'm what I'm getting at so once you buy another 100 pair and you sell those one that 100 pair you've officially made two thousand dollars from the wholesale program now with the two thousand with the two thousand dollars or with the seventeen hundred should I say since you already put your 295 back with your seventeen hundred dollars you're gonna move up in lashes to my spot I just added the 500 pair and this is to help y'all. So my 500 pair is 13.75. So we're gonna do 13.75 divided by 500. Two dollars and 75 cent per lash. Okay. Eventually, I'll add a 1,000 pairs, but right now we're gonna stop at the 500 so I can get y'all going, so I can put y'all, make y'all stair step up to to that level. Okay. So. If you're getting them for $275, like, y'all got to think about this. Like, this is crazy. When you order 500 pair and resell them for $10, you make $5,000. Do the math. I want you to do the math. Do the math. Did you do it? Did you get 5K? Did you do 500 pairs times $10? Okay. Okay. I just want to make sure that y'all seen that these numbers are real okay people are ordering and going up in lashes every time they purchase I've had so many people sell out I've had so many people tell me so much so many wonderful things about the journey that they're going through through my wholesale program and that's why I'm going to continue to do it so I just suggest if you're ready to stop playing mind you I didn't even say the profit I'm sorry hold on we, we didn't get to the good part you made $5,000 and you profited $3,625. Who don't want three bands from selling lashes? So my advice to you is to stop waiting for other people's approval. Stop waiting for somebody else to believe in you and your brand and your vision. Stop it. it there's no need for anybody to give you the, the approval or the say so because they're not going to be the ones. To, to get out there and market. They're not going to be the ones to get out there and push like how how you are. Right or wrong. All right. Now let me tell you something something else about my hotel program. I offer custom packaging, logo printing, okay? Anything you need, I can do for you. And I mean it's just as simple as that. I suggest up until you get into about 50 pairs, get get the free boxes. And let me tell you why. It is so easy to get off lashes in these free boxes. Let me show you. Here's my holographic box. And let me tell you what 
I can sell this for ten dollars. I can easily, I hope y'all can see this. I can easily get this off for ten dollars. Somebody will pull up on me to purchase this, and let me tell you why. The packaging, the presentation, and me, how I push for my brand. I gave y'all the tea. I'm giving y'all the tea. I, I gave y'all the tea on where to get the bags. Add a spoolie or two. This is Dollar Tree confetti. Sprinkle it at the bottom. Buy you some cheap thank you cards from Staples. Get your money. Okay? Don't worry about other people talking about, oh, it's oversaturated. You're not going to make any money, girl, boo. If I, if I don't listen to those same people telling me the same thing, I wouldn't be here talking to y'all today. I'm only speaking from what I've been through as a business owner. I started like this. This got me the sale. When when other people posted their products and, and I posted mine with that presentation, I got the sale. Regardless of who else was selling the same thing. You have to get creative. You have to use what you have to get what you want. I could use this pillow right here and put my lashes on it in a nice light and natural light. Take a picture and I will get the sale. Okay? Y'all have to believe in yourselves. Y'all have to be believe in y'all brand, y'all future brand. Y'all have to start thinking about you, yourself, generational wealth, and what you're going to do to support you for the rest of your life, okay? If the pandemic has showed us anything, it's that we need to start generating our own money, okay? Shopify recently offered me $27,000 to partner with them, basically, because they want to make sure that they're not losing out on money. They see my stores generating so much money during a pandemic. They want to make sure that they keep their business good and partner with people like me who know how to maneuver through things and, and I know how to get things done for myself, okay? So I'm gonna show y'all another one. This is another free packaging. I have a holographic box and I have a pink box. Like you get you get to pick and they're free. I, I give them to you for free to, to start you off because I believe in you, I believe in your vision, I believe in your brand, okay? You don't need my approval, you don't need my say so, but I'm doing this for the people who truly believe that they're meant to be business owners. So same thing this is my pink box different bag i mean you which one would you get in the comments right or left which one would you buy it's as simple as that y'all so that's going to be the end of this video um if you guys want a part two on this video for my other packages for my lip gloss for my sunglasses how you can make money on that please leave a comment if you're new to my channel, I hope this video helped you. I hope you subscribe. I hope you like my video. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for the support. I love you so, so, so much. Like, oh my God, I love y'all so much. Oh my God, so much. Um, I, would, I wouldn't even be here if it wasn't for y'all. I'm glad y'all gave me this platform to speak, to encourage, to inspire. And I'm here for y'all. Thank y'all so much. Make sure you sign up for my restock. I restock july 17th that's next friday this video is going up today um i hope that you guys have enough time to review this whole video i hope you have enough time to to think about it to do your own numbers figure out what you want to do and really sign up for that restock please take advantage i encourage you i pressure you i double dog dare you to purchase from my wholesale i mean who's gonna turn down a double dog dare like you scared you're supposed to be team too much you're not scared of anything Okay, so thank y'all so much. Um, that's all I gotta say. Until next time. Uh